Franklin County, Vermont Sheriff John Grismore back in court in Grand Isle County today for day two of his retrial for his assault case. NBC 5's Yunye Martinez has been there all day long. He joins us now live with the very latest. Yunye. Brian, things wrapped up around three this afternoon. Today solely focused on the state witnesses, which included several deputy sheriffs to take the stand. This morning started with the prosecution calling those witnesses. One deputy sheriff testified that he believes Grismore's action during Jeremy Burroughs' arrest were unnecessary and that no immediate rush was needed by Grismore. Around two this afternoon, the alleged victim Jeremy Burroughs also took the stand. Burroughs acknowledged he was off his medication and intoxicated at the time of the incident. But he recalls being kicked and remembers the two deputy sheriffs who arrested him. Uh, there was no immediate rush to the situation. I mean, we didn't have, you know, obviously we tried to get people in that as fast as possible, but it's, you know, partially contingent on their behavior. Remember a little bit of the incident where I got kicked there, and I didn't know who, what was going on, so I was kind of shocked all at once, plus I was drunk too, so everything at once. Sheriff John Grismore attorney Robert Kaplan continued to question Burroughs, including his previous social media post about the kick in question. Tomorrow, the defense will begin calling their witness, which you will see John Grismore, who will be defending himself in the case. But live in North Hero, Union Martinez, NBC5 News.